I don't think I'm going to need this today, but I've got it anyway. I might need it. I'm back. This is probably going to be a very, very short video, but here we are. Welcome back to the toolbox where I share some of the best mods and assets I use in my builds, giving full props to the creator and of course that all important download link that'll be in the description below. Up until finding this mod, this was probably the most mundane task I had in Transport Fever 2, putting signals on long stretches of track at a certain distance to keep my traffic flowing. That was until Autosig arrived. Created by Enzo Jay-Z, this mod allows you to signal long stretches of track with just one click. Not only that, but you can set the distance between signals. I find the default length of 500 meters is actually rather nice. It keeps traffic moving nicely and seems to keep my trains running at a good speed with little to no holdups. Although on busier stretches of track, I do actually quite like using 300 meters. I just find that it keeps the traffic moving even more. There's also the ability to set the signals to one way, which is a nice touch. And it appears that I will need the iPad because I do have a few notes here. Um, just remember, once you've finished auto-sigging, I seem to have written here, that's going to be a thing now, auto-sigging, to switch it back off, especially when you're using something like the Freestyle Train Station mod, I find because that uses waypoints to set the distance and the length of the station itself, if it's still on auto-sig, it will treat that as you want waypoints every X amount of meters, for example, 500 and you'll find yourself, if you're like me, getting ever so confused at why your station won't create itself and you're getting constant errors until that light bulb goes off on my head that I've left auto sig on and that's why it's not working. And I do have some more notes. Oh, if you're using any assets, anything like the flyover junction asset, anything like that that's in the track, it will the auto sig will stop. So what it will do from the point you set your first signal and then let's say for example it is 500 meters after the auto sig mod will stop and only fit every 500 if it can't fit another one before the asset it will stop and won't lay another one it's also the same with switches as well it will stop creating signals at a switch and you'd have to carry on after that and it's the same with station platforms as well it will stop and won't create any station or any signals on the platforms obviously and it won't continue after the platform it will stop at that point Thanks to Enzo Jay-Z for creating this awesome mod. Super helpful, saves a ton of time. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to drop a like. And if you haven't already, subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.